know they knew it's me love if you're new to my channel i want to say hey returning viewer what it do gang gang today's video is a spend a friday night with me uh today is technically my friday because i worked last night third shift so it's a three-day weekend for me so saturday which is today will be my friday saturday sunday so today is my Friday for my three day weekend. Stop that Duncan, per usual. As y'all see, I did go to Metro Market and get a few items. I want me and Chimera to make some ghost shaped pizza, which is a little different. He's bigger now, so he'll be able to make his own pizza a little bit. So I just wanna see, you know, how that goes. I got us some cinnamon rolls. So for a sweet later today, we'll make some cinnamon buns some center rows and let's get into some mini life updates turn this music all the way down let's start with the positives so my main thing for the month of october slash beginning of november i have rescheduled to take my medical assistance exam for november 4th so yay finally i'm excited to do that um i'll go more into detail about that when i talk about the less positive updates in life but yeah i'm excited about that and i just put my prayers in that hopefully i pass because your girl your girl needs it okay oh secondly youtube sent me a email my second year mark of being consistent with youtube i'm so happy you guys i've been consistent as much as possible as i can I'm trying to put the work in to let y'all know that this is not temporary i do want to assist it with you guys so you guys can get to know me i also did hit 300 subscribers not too long ago so cheers to that we are on the road to 400 subscribers and yeah let's just make sure you like comment and subscribe on this video share with a friend to tell a friend to tell a friend okay i do wish that i could have got a cake like to put two years on it or something like that but i i don't think i am going to do that uh i'm just gonna wait on that until i hit my 400 subscribers to talk about the list so positive side um oh as far as my career path in all honesty you guys um working at these jobs like with my caregiving certificates i'm honestly fed up with it and i don't know if nursing is for me anymore and I, it sucks to say that these jobs are making me realize that. But I don't know if it's the jobs or they have okay. management, everything. So I just, I don't know, y'all. We're, we're going to see. But as of right now, I don't think nursing is my main career goal at this point. It looks like my camera is moving. I hope not, you guys. I've been to exploring other options. Pick the silk press, though okay get the silk press i'll just keep y'all updated as time goes secondly let's get into my dating life nunu is officially off the market because i'm done dating this group of society of men this generation of men is horrible first of all y'all have no provider instincts whatsoever okay um i don't know what it is but y'all are sassy no provider instincts whatsoever like why what makes you think that you finna put a 500 uh, uh 500 800 phone in my name my name i don't even have a phone for my son in my name why would i get like baby don't get me started don't get me started then my ex here go my ex can i get some money so i can put some air in my tire you don't even have money for air in your tire mm -mm. baby air is about a dollar or some change you don't have that but you got kids so how the f do, like that's i that's really what i be thinking you got kids so how do you not have it that's where i be confused because if you can't then asking to pay for an uber this this is somebody else i'm talking about asking me to pay for an uber you can't get around yeah heavy on the bro key I, I just cannot i can't you guys I, dating right now is just not for me i'm off the market i'm cool i i'm cool y'all might see me with a little sneaky link well y'all not gonna see me with a sneaky link let me rephrase that y'all might hear about me being with a sneaky link but 
other than that, I'm cool on dating. Sorry, y'all, if I keep looking around, I'm kind of just checking the scenery out. Just looking. The wind is blowing. The trees are swaying. The leaves are falling. It's giving fall. It's so cute. But, and then third and finally, I am 110% sure that I am moving out of Milwaukee. There's certain opinions and that things that people say that bothers me and it breaks my heart. I have been working my tail off to save so I can start getting ready to move because I'm, I'm sure like this is what I want to do. I don't care if I have to do it alone by myself or if my brothers want to come with me, but I just, I have to do it. I have to be the one to just do it and just go for it. Um, I feel like Milwaukee is not a family city anymore as it used to be. They don't care who you are, kid, mama, whoever. And I know Branson is it's violence and stuff everywhere but it just seems like the rates has been very tremendously high here and i love my life and i love my son ain't nothing gonna come before us but god so it's just time for a change and i want to live to grow old to see my son to see to see my son grow to see his kids grow like mm -mm. I think that's pretty much it for the life updates and my little intro that I have for you guys. I'm sorry that I did ramble a lot, <laughs> but I'm about to go in the house, probably get ready in a little bit because today is my niece's birthday, Journey Girl. Today we're supposed to be going skating, but I'm not sure as of right now. Um, I haven't heard anybody mention anything about it. So, um, I'm going to go in the house, check the temperature, see if we're still going skating. Um, it's my birthday. It's my birthday. So I'm in first place. I'm in first place. Yeah. Let's go. Let's go. I'm was <laughs> 8 to 8. I was 8 to 9. I was 20 to 9. Oh, never mind. I'm in my room. Woman drawing LFUJ album covers with Crayolas on construction paper. I'm trying to fuck my neighbor. I'm trying to hook my ways up. I'm trying to pull my grades up. They get them saddle lace ups. Before Lamar was Jacob. Before them girls wore makeup. Before my boys would break up. Before we put them shake clubs. Before my mama wake up. Before my palms would cake up. Before they tell me they love me. Say, so what's your name? Your birthday girl. And how old are you? Five. Yes. Can I see? How many? Five, yeah. But of course, and a sort, men of talk, just that sport, just the skin. When they enter in truth, there's who's true, there's dead, a lousy job. Lousy God, if he lets loose up, let loose on us, that new phone us won't loosen up, but loose enough to juice us up. Make us think we do so much and do it big, like they don't let us win. I can't pretend, but I do admit it. Feel good when the hood pseudo celebrate. Hence why every time we dine, we until our belly ache. Then go grab the finest wine and drink it like we know which grape in which region it came from, as if we can name them. It hit, it ain't no well, just help, just fill 3,000 more. That means cool. Birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday. Oh. Yeah. Yay! Selling, selling's a sin. We're so is telling young men. That selling is a sin if you don't offer new ways to win. A dolphin gon' shake his fin, regardless if he gets in or out of order. Most important thing for him is to swim and flip it then hold his nose. So why shall I hold my tongue? I miss the days I old when one can hold his dowel on his arm. And I set off these alarms when camera. Hey y'all, we just got back home. Chuck E. Cheese was overwhelming. Just a little bit. It wasn't packed, but it just was like 10 years older, so now he's trying to get into things. Like right now, oh my god. I had to kick him out because he wanted our time to talk. Attention span in there was like short. Like you scan for him to play for one game, he on to the next already. And my journey girl, she had fun. I think all the kids had fun. I think the cake has some melatonin, cause baby. On the way home, I'm not enough. I'm wrapping my hair because it started on my routine and give me a nice hot bath because it's been a long week. Gonna talk about the way I wrap my hair because I'm just a girl. I'm just a girl. Hey guys, Good enough. <laughs> Probably gonna take me a bath tomorrow. Uh -huh. Also, today is Sweetest Day. Happy Sweetest Day to the sweeties out there. 
But yeah, I'm about to get this one ready for bed because he is on a roll. And also, I'm going to vlog a little bit tomorrow just because I didn't want to make our pizza, our ghost pizza, and I didn't get to. So tomorrow, I'm going to vlog a little bit just to make it a full 24 hours. Have a good night, and I'll see you guys in the morning. Hey, y'all. I was saying good morning, but the morning is over. I woke up today. I'm feeling better than I did last night. Last night, I kind of had a stomach ache. Today, this morning, I had a good morning. I went to church this morning virtually. I don't think I can zoom in, but these are my notes from church. And the main thing he's been talking about, I guess, for the last couple of weeks is courage. Number eight represents new beginnings. Doing anything new, you need courage. So he talked about how Paul got on the boat and um, for the first time going around, he needed courage. With courage comes boldness. He talked about how Peter um, had to pray. It's because they were threatening him if he spoke about God or whatever again. So he prayed for courage and for boldness. And he talked about how the Holy Spirit is filled with boldness today i felt like he was talking about me he um was saying some things those are the things that i talked about with my mom which makes it be like whoa like it, it felt like he was literally attacking me yeah church was good i am about to close this up <sighs> let's head into the bathroom i'm gonna take me a bath so yeah real quick me time not mommy and me or mommy and whoever just mommy time to just take a bath and relax this is a gift that my auntie got me for finishing school this was one of the gifts and the packaging eats down okay a cup that says not a day over fabulous cute and then a straw and a straw cleaner this is some um, soap epsom salt but and then i have a bath bomb i'm gonna wait on the bath bomb um, oh it's a candle and it smells so it's a candle and it smells good really everything in this box smells good and then this is a little card that comes with it mix it with the with the other one okay, so i'm gonna use this actually Chimera is outside playing with his cousin, which is probably why y'all just heard him. I got this window open and the camera's running because I need to hear and be able to see what is going on. Once I take my bath, Chimera will be going down for a nap. After that, we're going to make the pizzas. Finally, even though we just had pizza yesterday, we're going to make some pizzas and some center rolls. I'm about to freshen up, get myself together. Probably do something with my hair because it's still in a wrap run this bath because it is well overdue.
<laughs> I just finished making our ghost pizza. And I'm not gonna lie, it's giving ghost. We did burn it a little bit. Oh, I should have put bacon on here. I should have put bacon on here. But that's alright, that's okay. Let me cut it up so we can try a slice. The bottom half clearly is mine because Chimera is not gonna eat the jalapeno. everybody is having a good day he's watching in concert let's take a bite it's still hot That was good. I'm trying to eat it and it's burning on my foot. It's good though. What all do y'all like in y'all pizza? Comment below. Let me know. I know some people put pineapple. I don't know how I feel about the pineapple. Right now, on this lovely Sunday, it is 6.42. And I'm just editing this video right now. Kind of, I've been off my schedule a little bit. I missed last week upload because I plan on dropping two videos within less than seven days apart. So be on the lookout for that. I'm about to cut up the other half of this pizza, let it cool down so Chimera can eat. Keep editing. Sorry for the much. I told y'all it's hot. So. It's kind of early, but they already got started on dinner, which is, it looks like baked chicken, maybe smothered chicken. I don't quite know yet, but dinner's ready to roll, probably in like another 30 minutes or so. And once everything comes out the oven, I'll make some cinnabons. Time to make the cinnabons. Drive my damn self. I can't go to the gas station. I don't even need this house. That's bad. Yeah, there you go. I sure am. Listen, I'm leaving that in there. When you go to the gas station, ask for some Rolex. That's the gas station. Oh, that's my old people. Can you see my damn government? What the fuck? This smell, why not? You're tripping to me. How many is it out of them? How many did it say on the pack? <laughs> It is a mess in here right now. I'm not doing another pan. These going to have to fit in here somehow. So I don't have the outcome of the Cinnabons. I did burn them slightly, but they were still good. I gave it maybe the 8 out of 10. I can't be mad at nobody but myself, to be honest. We have came to the end of this vlog. I hope you guys enjoyed, and I can't wait to see y'all in the next video. Thank you guys for watching. Bye! Trust in me I can't You said I can't trust in you